guys, what's up? It's me, Audra. Welcome back to my channel. For those of you that are new, I'm not sure how you got here, but certainly I'm glad you came. Okay, guys, it's New Year's Eve! Okay, I'm done. I'm done being a weirdo. Since it's New Year's Eve, I'm just having a little bit of coffee to prepare myself for the inevitable wreckness of what's to come. I am pretty well certain that things are going to go beyond my expectations. Bo is running amok. My skin is dewy as fuck. All right, guys, I'm here with a Stitch Fix. I feel like this will be the first ever that I've actually gotten it on, like, on New Year's Eve and have it. I wonder if it'll make me feel New Year's Eve festive. Like, will it? Will it? Anything that I want to keep to wear out. Now, my New Year's, guys, is very, very casual. Like, I don't... I don't wear like the whole shebang. I used to do that, but honey, I'm old and I don't, uh, that's just too much work. I'm not gonna be out in high heels all night. It's chucks. I am not gonna be wearing a dress that I'm gonna get tired of and eventually get hot. And because of, you know, the general nature of menopause, I am more than likely gonna be like, I'm taking this dress off like a crazy person. And that's how my New Year's has gone in the past. Now you know. All right, so let's go ahead, do the try-on, funky music, crazy dancing, beware of dog kisses, and let's have some fun, and we'll be back. Ew. I woke up in a daze, you were talking to me, so I fake like something you say, I just couldn't believe.
a wee bastard. You tried to get me this time, didn't ya? Okay, I'm back. <gasps> Sorry, <laughs> I was having a moment. Try on has been completed, and uh, this was. <laughs> I loved everything. I even like this necklace a lot. I, it's not like I don't have one like this, but I like it. And I had really been considering keeping everything. That is until I looked at the prices. I'm sure you guys saw it. And did you gasp? Did you have a shit fit, if you will? Let's find out. Let us first start with the DL1961 jeans. Girl, these fit like a dream, but my dreams, my dreams don't include a $128 pair of jeans. A hundred and twenty-eight dollars. A hundred and twenty-eight dollars. What? What? They fit amazingly well. I actually loved all of the additional uh, fabric at the bottom because when you wash jeans, that additional fabric becomes like normal fabric. That's what I found for me. So for that reason, they have to go back in the bag. And for reasons beyond me, I have two. I have two bags. But only one of them has the right stuff. So let's make sure we put it in the right bag. <laughs> We are playing a pretty rough game of go back in the bag because I love these jeans. If they were like, if they had been like 80 bucks, I, I actually would have kept them, even though normally I'm like, man, I'm not paying that for jeans. But because of how they fit, I would have kept them. But bitch, $128? Get the fuck out of here. Who do I think I am? Didn't I just explain that I'm not a rich bitch? Okay, moving on. So next up we have this super duper cute top by Market and Spruce. I loved it. It was $54. And see, that was a thing. I really would have kept this. But like, damn, Gina. I'm just going to tell you the total right now because like when I heard the to total, like I got so startled. I farted. So when I looked at the total, it was $436. Like, how do you not surprise far? Just like, oh! So, anyway, with the buy all discount, I get $109 off, bringing that total down to $327. And really, it's down to two items that are really kicking my ass on that price a pair of jeans and that gorgeous jumpsuit, bitch. Why? Why you gotta do me like that? <laughs> Why? So yeah, I'm definitely putting that back in the bag because, bitch, I, I can't. I can't. I cannot. <laughs> like maybe if something crazy happened where I suddenly had a significant amount of money, I would buy, I, but it's so gorgeous. It's absolutely beautiful, but damn. I am not, I can't, I can't, I can't. It's going back in the bag. Mm-mm, no honey. Now, fun fact, I really would have kept this necklace if everything had been in line. Uh, <laughs> wow. Um, <laughs> I am still in shock. But the one thing I am going to keep for sure, because you guys know your girl can't, can't get rid of a jacket. This jacket is bomb AF. I'm keeping it. It's $78, it's a good price for this awesome faux leather jacket. Faux, faux leather jacket, faux. All right, off goes my son. So yeah, I'm keeping the jacket. It's bomb, it's sexy, it's cute, and I can wear that for years to come. So let's go ahead and take off this necklace because I don't care that it's only $28. Um, wow, so here's the weird... I just am confused. I think it's because I said, go ahead and try to send me like expensive ass items one more time. And it's like, I want to keep it. <sighs> but it's like, I can't keep it. $327 for five items. Like I would kick my own ass over and over again, up and down the street. So you guys let me know in the comments, what do you think? Would you just like be like, no, no, no? Or would you be like, maybe, perhaps. 
I feel like telling this whole stitch fix, like, perhaps, perhaps, perhaps. <laughs> But I don't know. You guys let me know. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's definitely time for me to take Mr. Bo out for his last runaround of the day. If you did, please go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe. It's a good time. Hit that notification bell. Let's have fun together. Happy New Year, you guys. I love each and every single one of you. And until next time, peace.